Hello everyone, welcome to this tutorial. I am Nazmul Islam from Classydeps and in this tutorial, I am going to show you how to add or edit the categories in PrestaShop. At first, I would like to show you how to add the categories in PrestaShop and it is very easy to add the categories in PrestaShop. At first, I have logged in to the back office. Now, to edit the categories, just click on the catalog and click the categories. The right side of the top you can see the add new categories currently we have three categories so we will add the new categories click on the add new categories okay now we will write the category name here furniture and we can change the language from here however it will display yes because we want to display it in our category and it will the parent category from the home yes it will parent category from the home so we can add the subcategory also however we can add the description here so this description will show below the category like this category name so below it we can see the description here so if we write it the description here then it will show like this and here you can see the category cover image so we can add the category category cover image here so this cover image will show like this then we can also add the category thumbnail but this thumbnail will show you if your theme is allow it otherwise it will not show and you also can add the menu thumbnail so that beside the menu you can see the image with the menu and here you can see the SEO preview. So when you will search on the Google or some search engine, so you will see that there is some result with the title, with the URL, with the description. So we can customize it from here. So if you want to customize your category, that your category will show you in the search result in different way, then you can do that from here. So meta title is that title meta title is that title that will represent your pages your categories so we will add furniture shop meta description so in this description you can see it in the google search result so we also can preview it here So Google will show this result. Meta title, meta description, both are very important for the search engine result. So if you if you make the meta description eye catching, then the probability of the accessing of your site will be high and the traffic will be increased. So you should definitely concentrate to your meta description. You have to write the important sentence that will represent your store. So if you want to learn more about the meta title, meta description, meta keyword, then you can read our article. We already read the article, meta tags in Pesta Shop, and we will put this link in our YouTube description. So you can see about the importance of meta tags in Pesta Shop. Here we can explain the everything. However, there is meta keyword. So you have to add the meta keywords with the comma like what people search like furniture buy so this is the meta keyword furniture shop so if you want to get the idea about the meta keywords then you can search from the google search result furniture shop so you can see the search related result and you can use this kind of thing because people also search this kind of things however here is the fairly url furniture because it, it is already taken from the title but we also can customize it friendly url so friendly url it will show you after your main url your main url our main url is that so after that our 
categories URLs show here. So we, we can customize it from here. And if you want, you can add the furniture shop. And you can change it. You can see the change here. Okay. Now click on save. So before that, you can see group access. We want to show this the, for this category visitor, guest, customer. Everyone can see this category. However, we can click on save. So this category is saved successfully creation. You can see that there is total four categories. Now you can refresh button here. So you can see that there is nothing added. Just three before we can see. So to add this menu in here, we have to go to module and then module manager search menu. Here's you can see the main menu. Click on configure. So just find our recent added categories from available item. You can see categories. Furniture. This is our categories we have already created. Click on add. Click on save. Okay, the setting have been updated. So now it's time to check our category is added or not. Yes, uh, our category is added. So if you want, you can edit this category. Just go to the catalog categories and click on edit. So you can customize it. This is all about our tutorial. If you like this tutorial, just hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe our channel to get the more video about the PrestaShop.